Hey, Rafford Jake here. Today I'm joined by Marsha and Ariel from Hope and Anchor English Pub. How are you ladies doing today? Good, hi. Good. So tell me a little bit for those that have been living under a rock and don't know what the Hope and Anchor is, what are you all about here? We are an English pub. The owner um, of the pub is from England, so my Very authentic. And his mom came here. They brought over some of the recipes that they're used to. Nice. They get a little piece of England while living in Love's Park. Very cool. And so obviously things are a little bit different, so they can't come and enjoy the English pub decor and the vibe that's here inside, but they can get your delicious food and bring it home, right? Of course. So tell me a little bit about like what are some options here as far as your curbside pickup and to go? Well, we have the family meal deal, right? Mm -hmm. The family feast? Yes, family feast for $40. Feeds four to six people. And you have your options of pork poutine, cottage pie, uh, the grown up mac and cheese, and of course the best, the fish and chips. Nice. So tell me, what is cottage pie? I've heard of shepherd's pie, but not cottage. So cottage pie is a mixture of ground beef, carrots, mushrooms, onions, and gravy, and then it's topped with mashed potatoes. That does sound super so good. So shepherd's pie is what they're used to over there, but for get a little different here, here. We call it cottage pie to put our own spit on it. Nice. Yeah, shepherd's pie is made with lamb, but cottage pie is made with beef. All right, and then uh, here in front of us, we have some crawlers and growlers. Yes, sir. Yeah, buddy. So you guys are offering the crawlers and growlers now. Yes. And what is? I mean, in terms of beer, like Hope and Anchor is known for one thing, right? Beer. Beer. <laughs> <laughs> well, in Guinness specifically. Right. Yes. So, um, like in interviews of previous years here, back in Rock or Buzz days, uh, I know that the bartenders are all trained in Guinness. Right. We so tell me a little bit about by that. The Guinness um, people came out from the Guinness factory to train us. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. So for those that are looking for like your expert Guinness pour, they can find it here and now you can even bring home all the Guinness in the form of a crawler or a growler. Right. The best Guinness in the area. <laughs> Absolutely. And then there's a little shop behind us that I'll drop some footage in, but what is up with the shop? So the sweet shop has a bunch of different imported goods and candies that we actually get from England and bring them here for you. We've also got our t-shirts. The crawlers and growlers and different glasswares we have that one. are able to purchase. We have one pub in a box? Yes. Fantastic. Yes. <laughs> Phone rings. Uh, <laughs> the growler is the 64 ounce and it's $19 to purchase it, which you can always bring it back and we'll wash it and refill it for you. Yeah. So that's 19 and the growler is 32 ounces and that's 1150 to purchase and fill. Perfect. So for those that want to kind of um, be able to place some orders and like stay up to date with all your specials, uh, where can they go to find out and get more information? They can call us here at the pub. Follow our Facebook page. Or follow our Facebook page, our website. We are also on beermenus.com under the Hope and Anchor. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, ladies, for taking the time to get together and chat. And thank you, Rockford, for tuning in. A uh, big shout out to all of our business sponsors and our backers that make content like this possible. It's because of their support. I'm able to highlight local businesses and restaurants like the Hope and Anchor here. Uh, so big shout out and thank you to them. And we will see you on the flip side. Bye, Rockford. Bye.